Hello and welcome to another video. Um, this is my little Minecraft character that I made in a few minutes in the Minecraft editor. Just as a little bit of fun. I tried to make him look a bit like me and I decided to give him a redstone uh, like robot arm just because I thought that looked cool. Um, so yeah, let's get into this. Oh, there it is. It's like gaming star. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Don't know why, but I thought it was um, Derptopia, and the Derptopia was like, what the fuck was I being? How did I come to that conclusion? Yes, but I've done a good bit of work since the last time, um, since the live stream last time, and um, yeah, most of it not very interesting. Most of it was just building a bridge. So um, last time uh, I built this island, built this little island, built this bridge. Built this little island, and then uh, uh, went off to play Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX. Came back, uh, labeled that for like the Auto Seeds Farm, labeled that for the bamboo, and um, labeled uh, where the other areas are going to go. So over here is where we're going to have the housing houses and housing area. Over there is where we're going to have like um, community builds, so like um, community smeltery, like pixel art, and you know stuff like that. I am really la liking how high up we have this because it's not so high up that you can't see the ground, but it's high up enough to know for you to know like yeah, if I fall off this, I'm probably gonna die, and yeah, I like it. And uh, I didn't really do much in the um, building wise. I did get some gear. I got something like gifted something like for. Got to uh, worked for some diamond armor. Got some stuff. Somebody attacked a zombie pigman in the Nether, and when I came through a Nether portal, I got attacked by a zombie pigman, which was not fun. Oh, you've fixed yourself, and so has your friend, because um, that chicken and another chicken were here and here, trying to jump up to here, but the slabs were blocking their uh, way up there. So I don't know what the Minecraft Pathfinding AI was. Uh, thinking of that don't kill the cow chicken that cow naturally spawned up here he has uh, just as many rights as you to be up here anyway uh started making some tree farms so we've got birch up um i still need a few saplings like you can see one missing there 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 and there um so i'm gonna need a few more birch saplings but that's um coming along and we've got little areas for like saplings which are you know, logs slab slabs and planks mainly because um slabs are used here so on these so um if these need repairing can just make a few slabs put them around and then just put the remaining slabs in there uh we've got oak trees and um what's special here with the oak trees is that we've got blocks 10 blocks above uh, uh, from you know, uh, from the sapling, so t nine blocks above it, with the tenth block being the block that the sapling is sat on. This will prevent any of these trees from growing too large and being all big and messy and a pain in the bum to take down. Meaning that you really have no um, excuse for not um, for leaving floating trees. So they'll be around the same size as them, with some growing a little bit bigger, but not by much. Um, and over here. We have, uh, I was, uh, I've started building the spruce one, which will uh, be um, two by twos, uh, growing these massive spruce trees. Um, now I don't, uh, uh, that one has grown naturally without me using any bone meal on it, but I don't think this, uh, they're going to grow extremely fast, so uh, it's a good thing we're not far away from the bone, uh, the um, skeleton farm, and I haven't put bottoms on these yet. Um, which is something I'll probably do off screen again. God damn it! Now there's a pig and a cow doing it. Why Minecraft Pathfinding AI? Why? What? Uh, why? Why do you do this? Anyway, um, moving on before I go insane from that. Um, I am planning on building a shop, uh, but my shop will uh, require. Uh, it'll be like a handyman shop, so you'll basically leave jobs for me to do. You like write in a uh, uh, book and quill what the job is, you know, relative information, what you're willing to pay me, and like um, contact information and whatever. 
uh, and then just like leave it in the shop and then I come around every so often, check for jobs and then, you know, do the jobs and it's a way for me to make some diamonds, basically. And maybe some iron and gold if it's for smaller jobs. But basically for that I'm, I'm going to need to make um, booking quills, which I am going to need uh, feathers. So I want to start making an egg farm here so I can use those eggs to make chickens for um, feathers and meat. So, um, we need a hopper, which I somewhat short-sightedly sold all of my iron blocks for diamonds. And I think I got eight, nine diamonds out of it. Uh, for fi Nine diamonds for 57 blocks of iron. Uh, because there is no iron farm on this realm yet, which is a um, eventual uh, thing that will be up there, which, um, yeah, I'll probably sell iron, 64 iron ingots for a stack. Yeah, I've pretty much wrecked this entire area, um, and I'll show you why later. Um, yeah. Oh. Um, but let's see how much iron I have left after selling. Like 99% of it. Mm. I have two ingots. Those are blocks of quartz. And three mm. iron ore. Um, got some leftover bricks. This will actually be enough to get me one hopper, which is all I really need right now. I just got to find my lead. So I do believe I have some leads somewhere. Leads. Ah, here we go. Nine leads. And I'm going to sleep quickly. Uh, villagers. So, yeah. Um, which, there we go. So that's five iron ingots. So that's enough to make one hopper, exactly. So let's go make that hopper then. Right, so, uh, got some birch logs in here, I think, yes I do, turn them into birch planks, one for the hopper and then a double chest. Mm. So, yeah, I got that gold sword from the from the pigman. Come on, Chuck. Yeah. Well, while we're making the chicken, um, while I'm making the chicken farm, might as well talk about uh, m my experiences with um, chickens uh, IRL. Um, I have actually taken care of uh, chickens myself in real life. Um, and uh, I will say that chickens are probably 
one of the best pets you can uh, ever get. And uh, I absolutely loved having chickens. Um, it, it just buggered off. Anyway, um, the pets I've had uh, um, my entire life have been chickens, parrots, ducks, um, dogs, a cat. Um, so... Yeah, I've had uh, quite a variety of pets. Um, so, yeah, but to, out of all of them, I would say chickens were probably my favourite because you look after them, they lay eggs that you can eat, and uh, while the eggs can sometimes be a bit of a pain to get off them when they're broody, um, uh, if you don't know what broody, what, what it means when they go broody, it basically means if you try to take their eggs off you, they will take their eggs off and they will pick your hands off. Um, but it is rewarding because you do, again, they, you get food from them, um, and they, and the, the, despite what vegan, what some vegans might tell you that, um, taking chickens' eggs off them makes them depressed, that is completely bullshit. Um, as uh, someone who's actually taken care of chickens, I know that they really don't give a shit if you take their eggs off them. Um, unless they're broody. Uh, again, if they're broody, they will pick your hands off if you try and take their eggs. No, no, oh my god, damn it, chicken. Get over here. Oh. Right, get. What is with your pathfinding AI? Jesus. I know, get up here. I don't have any. S no, I don't. Oh, no. Oh, come on. Get back up here. Get back up here. Come yeah, on. Mm. Right, calm down. Right, calm. I hate you so much right now. Right, let's see if I can find some seeds. So I know that's what to, I know you'll uh, follow me even better if I have seeds. It's just easier to get you to follow me with a lead than seeds. Like, leads are better for um, long distance travel, but when you're doing, trying to get them into a one block by one block hole, seeds are definitely better. Oh, yes. 23 seeds. You want these, don't you? Oh, bok, 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 seeds, bok, 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 bok. I like seeds. But I don't like sand. It's coarse and rough and it gets everywhere. Oh, you popped out an egg over here. Yeah. Also, Minecraft is really unrealistic with egg laying because when chickens actually do lay eggs, it is really noisy. That pig is still stuck there, by the way. Still stood there. Uh, um, I'm gonna go get my eggs and see if I can get a chicken out of the eggs. Like it. Oh, imagine if in Minecraft, every time a chicken laid an egg, it just made it sound, just played a sound clip from it. Go, like, and then you had a massive egg farm. Just go, and then it would just be make they'd be making that noise all the time. Oh my god, it would drive you absolutely barmy. Uh, love it. I do not appear to have any eggs down here. Guess I'll go down to. Hold on, that being is that full of. Yeah, there's no eggs in there. Um, I'm gonna have to go down here. Well. 
I can just. And because I'm in bedrock, I can press A to cancel the uh, elytra. And that's how you know if someone's play, play mains, plays mainly on bedrock, if they tell you that you, you can cancel elytra by pressing A. Um, well, let's see here, eggs. Four eggs. Some seeds. Two more eggs. Um, what else? Ah, one more egg. Oh, what's in here? Ah, yes, building materials I got given as a gift while I was in the um, skelly spawner one time. Ah. Oh, that's not fair. That is not fair. Come on, game. Come on. Oh, fuck. If I kill him now, he'll instantly activate a raid. Alright, I'm gonna need to lure him out of the village. Mm. If I take the oh, I don't have any iron ingots. Mm. Why was he even in the hole in the first place? Seriously. Mm. And he's now he's disappeared. Don't know where. Yeah, um, a patrol, um, while they're building up at the Sky Islands, um, the, a patrol spawned up there, and uh, um, what was that, oh dear. Uh, it, was, it wasn't too difficult to take care of, I knocked one off the Sky Island and, uh, and took pot shots at the rest while hiding behind the, 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 um, the bridges, uh, pillars, so, yeah, wasn't too bad. Um, so yeah, got some eggs here, so might as well go and chuck them in. That's it. Oh. That's not good. Guess we're gonna have to go on a chicken hunt. Ooh. Hello. Would you like to come out with me to lay eggs for the rest of your life? Probably not, but they're coming anyway. Yeah, chick, 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 chickens, come lay little legs for me. There's a zombie somewhere. I just heard it. You guys can probably hear it as well, but yeah. Also, I probably should have test the um, volume settings on the game compared to my voice on this because it's a bit annoying because you have to turn like the game volume to like half down to half of this capture card. So what we have to do here is we have to get the chickens into the bubble vator and um, it doesn't matter if they get stuck they'll be perfectly fine because they'll get infinite oxygen from the bubbles. Yeah.
Into the water. In. In. To. The water. What? Hold on. Let me get some seeds out. Right, into the water. Up goes one. Up goes two. Oh, I love bubble vators. When they go up, when they're going down, they're, they're really not that efficient. Oh, come on. Here, man. Where, where has it gone? Silk touch shovel. How? How? Just how? I'm going to have to break that block. Place block. Hold out these seeds. Encourage it to come out. And then get this one over into the... To here. Now here's a cool... I'm going to show you a cool little trick you can do. Um, oh! A little trick you can do with any... Um, breedable mob farm, uh, like this. So what you do is, you right click them with the seeds, you right click that one with the seeds, and you get a baby and the chicken voluntarily goes into the hole. I think I have had it to that one time, um, they somehow made a baby without going into the hole. I don't know what witchcraft that chicken was doing to do that, but it did it. I can't. I can't remember if it was a chicken or a cow, but, but it would have been one of the two, uh, most likely. Yeah, uh, shite. Can't take that one off. Hold on. Ah, perfect. All right, now to sort out that other chicken. I think I was on this side. Where did that chicken go? Also, while I'm here. Well, that's one chicken that disappeared m under mysterious circumstances. Hmm. Let's go hunt down another one. Oh, no, 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 no. here. Oh, is that a chicken over there? Yes, it is. Oh, ha! <laughs> I hit the cow. Uh, any other chickens in the vicinity? I did not do that, by the way. That's naturally spawning generation bug. Oh, over there. Oh. 
Alright, I want to test something out. Being as chickens can't die from fall damage. What if I... No, that just killed one of them. So, yeah, not doing that again. Follow me, I have the seeds. Oh, seeds. I am mesmerized by the seeds. Oh my, Jiminy Cricket. Another one bites the dust. Another one. Another one. Another one bites the dust. Oh, I have three phantoms on me. Four, I have so many phantoms on me. Bugger off, bugger off, bugger off. Bam. Bam. I am the worst at aiming. Anyway, seeds. Into there quickly. So I'm not leaving without you. Ow. Oh, hello, Phantom. Apparently, Phantoms really don't like water. Come on. Oh, my. Hold on. There we go. I'll fix that in a moment. Oh, it's a phantom! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, stupid phantoms. Apparently the phantom AI is no better than the pig AI. to squeeze around you. Oh. I think that broke them. Yep. I'm getting really unlucky with these eggs today. You stupid! Yeah, stupid phantom! Blocks. Oh, I must have left him on Alpha. Six will do. Right, so that should start 
getting eggs in, but I'm going to want some more. So I'm going to build that up for a little while. Oh, I think one of them got itself, itself free. Stupid phantoms. I'm gonna have to put a trap door on there at some point. Because falling into that would be quite bad. I don't have a cow farm design just yet. Uh, that I want to what that I want to use right now. I go look up some automatic cow farms up on the internet. Build it in the redstone world uh, to test it quickly, and then build it in here. While they are laying eggs, I guess we, um, I could finish off. Uh, we could time lapse me doing this. Why am I over here? So, um, what I need here is, um, dirt, uh, oak wood, and then bitch. Oh! A bunch more trees have grown. I just realised that, so. Yeah, I'm gonna go get some dirt, some birch wood, and some oak wood. Yeah, I've only got eight dirt on me.
Okay, I'm back. So, yeah. That's uh, them mostly done. Um, ooh, five eggs. Let's see if we can get anything out of these five. Well, let's see if we can breed these first, though. I don't think you can breed them if they're scared of you, so just spam seeds in there. Oh! Feck. <gasps> that was almost the death of me. Now I gotta wait for these little guys to come down. Might as well grab the feet. Try to eat while I'm waiting. So, one, two, three. Actually, yeah, really good look there. With the eggs. One, two, two, three, four. Five. I caught chicks alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then I took them back up to the islands again. Why do you need to take them back up to the islands so they could lay eggs for me? So why do you want them to lay eggs for you so I can slaughter their species endlessly? So we just need to get these guys. Up here. Here, man. Oh, no. Damn it. How far up did they go? I'm going to have to use seeds for this part. Seed your little shirt. Go on into the water. There we go. Up you go. Up you go. If these get stuck, I'm going to be so bloody annoyed. Why did I leave that open? Oh, guess you probably can't. Why did they jump out? Just went to point seven. So we need to get you into this. Mm. All right, come on. Up you go. All the way to the top. And that one jumped down. That one got stuck. Alright, let's just head these three over to the egg laying area. Yeah, man. Now, I think what will happen, because these are babies, their AI will pathfind to the nearest adult chicken. 
if I take the wheat seeds out of my hands. Oh, no, 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 no. Right, you in there. You in there. There's another one. One's gone missing. Hey guys, I got seeds. You like seeds, don't you? Yeah, man. Up you go. And up you go. Yeah, man. I guess if it, I guess I can drown in the bubble baiters by the looks of it. I don't know why. Maybe that's a bug. Well, that one just jumped right in there. Why can't you be more like that one? Now I'm gonna break the lead by doing this. Okay, there we go. I think there should be enough chickens, hopefully. I'm going to put a trap door over it. Just in case I need to get back in there again sometime. Well, that should do it. And when I get a bunch of eggs, I can start... I'll probably go AFK to get a bunch of eggs. And then I can start building the, the one that will automatically... Um, dispense the eggs, then kill the baby chickens. Right, so maybe we can get started on one of these, or could end off here. Hmm. I think I'm going to end it off here, because we did a good uh, uh, bit of work. We got the chicken farm, well, egg farm, um, up and going. We got um, one of the... Oh, yeah, we need to get... Uh, something we can do quickly before I go is um, get the... Excuse me, get the um, acacia wood up, up and going. I dumped a bunch of stuff in this chest last night and I think I forgot about battle. Plant these and let's then let's go get some acacia saplings and then I have and then when we bring the acacia saplings back I'll end the episode off there. I'll probably sort that barrel out off screen. Cause I'm gonna need a lot of that stuff. So I have um been given some advice on where I could possibly uh, we'll probably find some acacia trees to chop down for their saplings. And I think it was the um, apocalypse zone. Oh yeah, and this is the this is this area is why a lot of the ground area is just ravaged because I was just like harvesting all the resources to build this. Um, 
So the apocalypse area should be wait. Oh. There we go. So Skelly Spawner, Modern, Ye Old Zone, Honeycomb, Sky Islands, whip. Narnia, Danktopia, Underwater, the Unnamed District, Mes Mesa, Biome, and Blaze Farm. Uh, if, it, if, any, if there's any of these you want me to go check out, put it down in the comments section. The Raid Arena, Jungle Zone, Apocalypse. Ah, here we go, Apocalypse. I believe there should be some acacia trees at Apocalypse. Uh, what's that? Desert. Let's put a mushroom there. Okay, damn it. Jungle. Oh. Yeah! Only problem with using the boat, it says. Ah, here we go, Apocalypse. Apocalypse. Magma blocks. Oh, Interesting, that's nice. So yeah, out. Like half of this, this is supposed to be like a house, half destroyed house. This is a much bigger area than my portal area. Mind you, I was. Uh, Building not too far from the honeycomb portal area, which um, yeah, that I did not want to interfere with that. So let's see. Ah, perfect. Not too far from the portal. Oh, look, the most pointless and one of the rarest structures in all of Minecraft. Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me! Yeah. Oh, and I forgot to explain um, the whole like setup for the trees. Oh, and it's also turning tonight. So, yeah. Don't think I'll be getting too many saplings. I think I'll just be getting like a handful of saplings and then going. I already hear a skeleton. There we go. Is there any beds over here actually? Beds. Uh, what's this? Danger, do not enter. Danks, safety, bunker. Um, I don't know if this do not enter is serious and I don't want to get in trouble. Could easily be a joke, could easily be real. And I do not want to uh, make Danks angry because she owns the realm. She and her girlfriend. Oh, there's phantoms. Fuck all, fuck off.
Phantom membranes really need a, an actually good use because all that they use for is repairing elytra, which um, they replace levers um, functionality for that. Um, and I think I've got plenty of saplings, so I'm going to leave now. Um, so they took uh, levers. Uh, um, job of repairing uh, Elytra and it, uh, then uh, it doesn't even matter because Elytra can have mending on it which makes oh fuck there's a spider in here which makes um it, which makes phantom membranes even more unnecessary. Like, if you can repair it using phantom membranes, then why can't you craft elytra out of phantom membranes? Or like, a, or like something similar to elytra. Like, seriously, they need a better use. Because they're literally worthless right now. I mean, the only worth they have is in the, the difficulty of acquiring them, and they're not even that difficult to acquire. I think that's just an exit into the never. Beware, exit, yeah, exit to never. So, yeah, um, also down the green one uh, Guardian Farm, Shopping District, M Mystic Mines, the Space Program, uh, Mushroom Biome, and the. Uh, I'll, 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 uh, I can't read that from here, I really can't. I need to build up to be able to read it. Oh. And, here we go. Also, a pig made his way into here, so now it's just a feature. Sleep. Get rid of the, all them phantoms. Right, so um, I'll explain the basic idea of the farm to you quickly before I go as well. Um, being as we're passing them on the way here to plant these saplings. Um, so the base design is uh, the birch, uh, birch farm because the birch ones you just really need to plan at um, a distance in between each other. So you could remove this block in the center and then put them next to each other and that would work. But I prefer it like this and it also makes it a bit easier to get around with the oak ones. Um... And yeah, and yeah, talking about the oak ones, pretty much the exact same design, except a uh, block above them to keep them from growing too big, which isn't even something necessary. You can just do it like that, but I don't like the big messy ones. Um, spruce is the same as the other two; is the same as birch, except that the dirt is a two by two, uh, with a one block ring of oak and then one block of birch in it. And I think this is more necessary to keep the birch area um, than the bit than the birch one because I think they need I think they're struggling to grow within the space that they've got already, let alone if you put them even closer to each other. And um, what I've done here for the acacia is I have uh, given them a bit uh, more space than any of the others because. These trees are a bit funny, are a bit weird with how they grow, um, and it, uh, they grow out quite far. So, um, if I get some bone meal, I can show you. But you saw um, at um, at um, apocalypse that um, yeah, they basically do have. You know, grow out a bit. So I given I've given them a bit more space to grow out a bit, um, and it, uh, this one was the most tricky of them all to really design, because um, I haven't tested it at all, and um, basically I've just 
done with my gut and just like, okay, this should hopefully be enough um, to give them enough room to grow. Um, and the, the, and the, um, this same basic design will be copied on the other side with jungle and dark oak. Um, so it'll basically be the same as spruce, but for jungle and dark oak. Yeah, also I put torches everywhere to um, help keep them lit up. Yeah, so they seem to be growing fine on here as it is right now. So yeah. Yeah, it's good. Uh, I'll do a little bit of work off camera and I'll see you guys uh, in the next video. Bye-bye.